one of the positive pieces of news, possibly the most positive piece of news that happened in the past week, which was Expedia, the hotel booking company, um, started accepting Bitcoin uh, this week for their business. So now you can book hotels and pay in Bitcoin. Which I got really excited about. And I think that's really awesome. Because uh, Expedia is, is like is one of the biggest, if not the biggest, uh, online uh, booking services. And um, the fact that they're accepting Bitcoin, I think it's just a monumental, uh, it's just a monumental advancement in the Bitcoin mm-hmm. economy. And they, um, they're starting out only with hotels, but um, they said that if it's successful, they'll move it into uh, other lines of service. And they provide things like, uh, they let you buy airplane tickets, cruise line tickets, and things like that. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Huh. You know, uh, do you think that Expedia accepting Bitcoin is kind of a bigger deal than the Dish Network thing? Um... My personal opinion is yes, just because of the the raw potential that it has. Um, because because now, if they expand it to uh, to airlines, now you'll yeah. be able to book a flight, get a hotel, and travel across borders. Uh, with and and the government will have a much harder time tracking what you're doing. <laughs> I didn't and, expect you to go there with that, but yeah, <laughs> yeah, that's true. From so from the libertarian point of view, I think it's much bigger than Dish Network accepting Bitcoin. Yeah. But um, the markets, of course, say otherwise because when Dish made their announcement, you know, price the price jumped up. like 40 yeah. bucks and ex- the Expedia, Expedia thing announcement. Happens, nothing happens and then yeah, it drops nothing happened. a couple days later. Um, but I think, I, think it'll, um, I think this Expedia deal will, uh, will start having an effect on the price when they actually implement it, when people actually start booking rooms yeah. with hotels. Yeah. And so I think, you know, like a few months down the road after uh, they've experimented with it a little bit and uh, depending on how successful it is, that's when we'll see the effect on uh, the price. Yeah, I think that Expedia is a bigger deal than um, Dish because like I, the Dish thing was announced and I was like, well, OK, that's great. That's a big company that they're, they're a mainstream like big uh, TV company. But like, who who has bitcoins and they can't wait to spend them on dish <laughs> service? You know, like who? Yeah. I, it's not me. It's not anyone I know. It's not a, anyone like on Reddit who is posting like, man, I wish I could buy some dish service with my bitcoins. Yeah. No, I think I think the the biggest thing that that uh, happened uh, because of dish was that um was that the Bitcoin trade got a little bit more mainstream. You know, like I said, I have this hypothesis that there that there were some uh, some stock market investors that got in on Bitcoin mm, because of the dish announcement. Dish. But right, but like you said, I just now thought of this uh, because you because you brought up you like who's buying Dish Network. You know, the television satellite cable uh, business, it's it's losing out big time to streaming sites like Hulu and Netflix. Yes. So, um, so yeah. When when you, when I think about it like that, Dish really isn't that big of a deal, uh, considering the fact that lots of people are leaving those traditional uh, yeah, yeah. services. Yeah, like if Netflix started taking Bitcoin, that would that yeah, would even be, be a bigger deal in my opinion big deal. than Dish. Yeah. But Expedia, Expedia is great. Now people will be able to book their hotels with Bitcoin. Um, you know, go traveling. And if you're right, if they open it up to paying for, you know, airline tickets as well, then uh, then all on the same site, you could get all your traveling expenses done with Bitcoin on the same site. I believe yeah. that there's already um, like an airline flight website where you can book a book a flight with Bitcoin. But, you know, if Expedia starts doing it, too, then you can do it all in one place. Yeah, there, like there's um, I know there is an airline. An airline that accepts Bitcoin uh, because uh, these documentary makers uh, they f- they flew like around the world uh, paid for by Bitcoin. So I know there's there's some airline yeah. that accepts it. Yeah. And there's a few small hotel booking websites that accept it, but Expedia is like you know Expedia is the giant. Yeah. And, it's they, the big and one. like like you said, they do all of that in one service.